How's it going guys? Gio here and today's app of the week is Almost DSLR. Dang it, wrong folder. <laughs> now Almost DSLR is basically what the name says. It is almost a DSLR, but not quite there yet. Um, what you got here is a whole ton load of features that the regular native camera app doesn't have. So for instance, let me go run through the features. You get your flash on off, that's kind of standard. Your torch on and off. Now you could use this in the camera also, as opposed to just having a flash in the camera. Now focus lock, if you say focus something up here, like really close, right there I got it focused, um, you could pretty much uh, focus on something far and it'll still be out of focus. So you don't get complete control, but you get just, just enough control for the iPhone as much as you could get. I don't think you could get any more control than that. And you got your mirror auto and you could turn that off too, but uh, yeah, this is only for if you've seen that, that um, SLR attachment for your cameras and stuff, but I don't know why you would want to do that, because you're taking SLR, like, you're using an SLR lens on a 5 megapixel sensor, that doesn't sound too good. Okay, why can't I close this? Okay, there you go. Um, you got your exposure, now you can set your exposure by double tapping on screen, now that's going to allow you to... Um, fix up your your brightness in the room now say you have a dark place now you're gonna want to focus on something dark and that's gonna brighten up your image going with the white balance uh, I'm not sure how to use this one yet I'm still exploring it you got your grids now this is a little bit helpful if you want to level up your image and leveling up your image provides you know more quality cameraman ship or something like that um yeah over here on the top, we have a camera switch option. Hey there, switch back, and we have a stop button or not? Sorry, not stop. You have a zoom button. I don't know why you would want to use this. It just kind of messes it up the image. But um, yeah, it's not gonna be how the final looks. So, so I like to keep it right here with the 1280 by 720 look. And right here we have the self timer. Now you can set it up to nine seconds, and nine seconds is a bit long depending on where you're gonna take a picture. But that's not the point right now. You also have camera stabilization. Now, no, this is not optical, so it's uh, all digital. And what it's gonna do is it's just gonna wait until your camera stops moving. Right when it stops moving, that's when you're gonna snap. Well, that's when it's gonna snap the picture. And over here on the bottom, you have the two buttons: the camera button and the video button now that's pretty simple that's that's not too much in this app actually but it's all really helpful going into the settings we have a uh, camera quality you can choose between 480 and 720 you can choose 480 for the iPhone but keep in mind that it's gonna shoot in a square if you don't like squares then keep it at 720 down here we have a uh, show focus just a couple of settings I don't wanna go through all of them because there's uh, a couple more and then show file saving, and that's pretty much, um, you know, showing file saving, like when you save the video or picture when you're going to do. Now, I find that the saving of videos on this is extremely fast. Yeah, I forgot to mention, this is a really cool part about it. You got your audio levels, and you could see that it's recording, or not recording right now, it's uh, showing it in decibels. You got your focus and exposure. I, I don't know all these settings. I'm not that pro with this yet. But yeah, I would find this super useful if I was a pro video, video er person. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today's app of the week, you guys. Stay tuned next time, and don't forget to subscribe. That'll notify you when I have a new video out. Clicking that like button will help me in the long run, and it'll make me more happy. So thanks for watching, you guys, and I'll see you all later.